This is Saronothoides. It's a member of the Trudon family, and we have discovered actual fossils of these dinosaurs sitting on a nest. It takes days to lay a full clutch of eggs, and until that's complete, this animal won't begin its brooding behavior and start sitting on the nest. With the Soronithoides of foraging, this unguarded nest provides an invitation for predators. This is an oviraptorid, a bizarre-looking theropod dinosaur. With no teeth, they were mostly plant eaters. But that doesn't mean it won't take advantage of a different kind of lunch. We know oviraptorids were mostly plant eaters because of some amazing evidence we have found. One fossil in particular was incredibly well preserved. Inside its body were small stones, gastroliths. Just like a bird, it had swallowed these to help digest tough plants. But when the remains of two unrelated embryos were discovered in an oviraptorid nest, it suggested that some were not just plant eaters, but may have been nest raiders as well. projections in its upper jaw, this oviraptorid has the tools to break into an egg and get at the precious contents inside. It means that a nesting animal like Saronothoides can never turn its attention away for long. but two lost eggs are the least of its problems. Here, some nest raiders are bigger than others. This is Gigantoraptor. Gigantoraptor was discovered in 2007 in the Gobi Desert of Mongolia. The sheer size of the bones revealed it was unlike anything found before. Eight meters long and weighing around one and a half tons. From its bones, we know it was 35 times bigger than its closest oviraptorid relatives. And yet this giant wasn't even fully grown. It was like finding a mouse the size of a cow. <laughs> <laughs> 